Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Hold Your Own. I'm the Radio Man 03, and it is awesome to have you along. We're picking up right where we left off last time. Uh, I, did, I didn't do anything but work all night long. Workbench. Boop. Just like that. We're good to go. I made a bunch of planks. I made a bunch of beams. Things like that. Oh, planks. Let's take those out of there. I'm trying to get things a little more organized. It's not that easy. How many nails do I have? Four. That's not enough to do anything with. Uh, the workbench, once I have it, we can make some nails. I believe this is where I make the nail molds and then I throw them in there. Oh, you know what I need first, though, is the anvil. Yes. Once we get the anvil in this bench, the saw bench would be nice to have as well. But the anvil, I can make uh, screws and nails on that, the molds with the stone and the clay. We can make more nails and then we can get to building. While we're waiting for this to craft, I'm thinking about putting our place right over here. And what I'm seeing in my head is, hey, all right, I thought, I, oh, I can't make, I can't do anything. This ax is shot. Oh, here we go. We got a brand new one right there. Boop. Uh, I thought I got rid of all this stuff over at, at night. It's very dark, though. It's very, very dark. Hope you're doing great. I'm doing fantastic. Again, I'm recording this episode right after the last one. So if you told me where the cave was, I did not get that message just yet. I'm thinking it is going to be over here. It looks to me like there's a path that even leads up to it. So I want to go see what that is over there. Uh, that's the direction we're going to be traveling. Uh, but right over here, I thought we do is a, a workstation. An outside workstation with the forges and stuff across the back and then a house that stretches out this way across here and then we've got plenty of room for our barns and stuff like that out here eventually defenses are coming to the game that you can put on your base to protect your base from the guards so I don't know that that's coming anytime soon but I know that they've talked about that that's something that they're going to do um, yeah but I can't make any nails or anything like that until we get uh, this bench put up and then I get an anvil going uh, boom there we goes okay perfect and so far I've not had any guards or anybody show up to do anything to me it's just been really quiet and let's go right over here this is all gonna be temporary we can pick these up and move them if you look if you don't know M to move M to move M to move the bed you gotta destroy but you can pick up all this stuff and move it so let's go in here uh, anvil what do we need for that we need 10 and 20 I think I actually have that uh, I do yeah I've got that right there so what was it 10 and 20 so I need some planks uh, let's grab these guys right here and let's throw these guys in there and then let's go ahead and get the anvil going too so that that takes care of all of my iron we got no iron to make nails but that's that's okay We've got this stuff going for us, so we're good to go there. Now, what do we need for the water catch basin, the water tank? Six screws. We have three. We need 15 bottles and three ingots. So we're going to need some more iron. So we might as well do that. How long is that going to take? Four and a half, four minutes and 40 seconds. I want to try to get some of our workstations going here so we have that stuff set up, and then we can kind of get going on the quest again. Let's head over this way. I've bumped up. Uh, our stuff to 101 if you it seems like if you just eat a little bit extra drink a little bit extra and stuff like that it bumps your uh, your margin up a little bit so you're 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 gaining some uh, a little bit of level which is kind of nice uh, I thought I saw yeah there's some iron right down in here this little valley is kind of cool I do want to head over and take a look at that place that area and see if that is a cave and if it's a cave that's really cool Really cool. I've not been in a cave yet in this game. And irons. Here we go. Nice. Nice little nugget of iron. Mm-hmm. It is still my Friday. It is Friday afternoon. Not uh, too late in the afternoon. I got about an hour and a half or so that I can record. And then I've got to call it a day. My daughter's coming up. We're going to have some fun tonight. Boom. Two. There it is. And a four. We're halfway there, people. It's a good thing. We're going to grab one more of these. So what is that? That's four ingot right there that we've got so far. I see another one right over here. Is there anything closer? No. And I'm keeping my eyes open for some of those smaller nodes as well. The coal and stuff like that. Those guys are tough to see, man. They are in the ground a little ways. And something else I've not come across yet is copper. I'm thinking maybe certain parts of the island, 
you're you're better you you're getting uh, you have a better chance of finding certain kind of uh, ores minerals. That eh, makes sense to me. So, well, while we're out and about today, we'll we'll see if we can find some. Uh, we've got another one right over here. We'll top our water off and food and all that good stuff when we we head back home. Uh, there's another one up the hill there. We'll just leave that one that was behind me there behind. We're gonna grab a couple more and go back, smelt these down, and, and get going. Matter of fact, why don't I do that and then I'll come back. Yo. Beautiful anvil ready. Sounds like uh, sounds like lunch is hanging around out here somewhere. Right between the eyes, just killed a swine too. Yep, little pig out in the woods, just walking around. Mm-hmm. That's good. I'll take the meat, and I'll take the fat, and I'll take that hide. Bring it in. That's it. Show the love. There we go. Beautiful. All right, sweet. Uh, I've got a little more iron going up as well. Smoke, um, I'm smeltering up some iron here, some iron ingots. I wound up coming back with actually a, a fair amount, actually. Uh, let's drop that in there and the fat and the hide going here. We're doing pretty good on the hide front. Fat? I don't know about that. Is, 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 it, is it disappearing on me? That's weird. I'm getting fat off of all the animals. Do I have it somewhere else? Oh, here it is. There it is. Okay. There it is. There we go. Okay, so I've got some water on me. Let's see what we can do about some food to get our food all the way up, and then we're going to head out the door here. Uh, we get... Yeah, let's just do that right there. Carbs are fine, I think. Uh, yeah, the carbs are fine. Oh, we had something spoil. I think it's the corn. I think the corn is spoiling. Yeah, I do. You know what? I'm going to take this can of food with me. Yeah, I think so. We've got six waters, so we're good there. Um, actually, you know what? These guys are going to spoil, too. There's no sense in letting them go to waste. I can't make anything out of them just yet anyways. You need quite a few berries to make a berry water, a juice box. It's like ten berries or something like that. So that's, you know, whatever. It's okay. 37 seconds for that to happen right there. Very nice. And nail mold. Uh, is this where I go to make the nail molds? No, I think it's in here. It is. Okay, so I need uh, stone and clay, and we're going to make up as many of those as we can so that we can have uh, plenty of nails. Uh, stone. Oh. There we go. And 18 of them. Sure. Why the heck not? Let's do that. And I ran out of fuel just as this was ending. That's not a good thing. Let's uh, grab a stack of that. And we'll drop that in there, and there we go. And continue to craft, please. At least it doesn't lose the time. Oh, thank God it doesn't lose the time and have to start all over again. That would be that would be frustrating right there. That would not be a good thing. Gold. Oh, there's there's gold in them there hills somewhere, huh? Nice. Awesome. Okay, so if I take those and I throw them in here. And I do iron fragments and max that out, bam, like so. That should give me a lot of iron fragments that I can use to uh, go ahead and get that going. And let's, we've got an axe on us, so we'll just, uh, yeah. Did I cook up all that iron? I didn't. Okay, so let's go one, two, three, four, five. Shift one. Inventory. We're going to need a new pick. I could probably grab some on the way out, but I thought, what the heck, we'll do this. Uh, oh, five wood. We might as well just, let's just do that. Inventory. We'll just do it that way right there. Iron pick and craft. There we go. And then we can throw that stuff back in there. It's all good to go. We've got a few extra posts with us as well, so I'm ready to go with that. Uh, I can make three foundations with that, so that's pretty nice. Is this done? It is done. Okay, beautiful. All right. And inventory and munch on that and that. And we'll hold on to that last one. Why not? And then let's go ahead and take these guys over here. Inventory and drink that up right there. It gives me 15 thirst. That's going to get me to 95. I think that's good. Uh, and then what do we need for this? Let's take a look at this real quick. The water tank. I need six screws. We're going to make some screws, weren't we? I should be drinking the water out of this. But when I get back... I can use those that we drink 
to uh, finish this off. I think I've got quite a few of those. I have nine, so that'll give us 15 right there. So that works out great. Um, screws. I think I had three. Where'd I put them? Come on now. I could have sworn I had three screws. They're in here already. Okay, so I've got a screw mold. Let's throw that back. Let's well, we gotta throw this back in here. We need to get our fragments out of here. We need to throw this back in here, and then the screws. Let's get the screws made before we take off. Let's just do one of those. And then nails. We can do two of those. Not going to take long at all, and then we're going to have what we need when we get back in order to make that water basin. All right, there we got eight of those. Nice, very good. Uh, we got some food to take with us. The carbs are good. The water's good. All, all that stuff is good. Our health's not 100%. There's a big town over here, so I think what we're going to do is we're going to go through the town and see if we can find a pharmacy. If we do see a pharmacy, I want to go in it real quick, loot it for bandages or anything like that, and then just keep on going and we'll we'll check that town out later okay so beautiful we've got that going for us as well all right let's turn that off and you are making more molds okay so that's all ready to go all right let's uh let's head for the road let's head for the road inventory i'm making a wasn't i making a pick there it is right there okay beautiful we got a pick in our inventory all right we're good I think I may stop for animals as well uh, to hunt them if need be because I feel like the hide is going to get to be pretty important here a little further down the road. So yeah, we want to make sure we have plenty of hide. But I'm hoping the cave is going to be, you know, over this way. We can run this way, I think. Well, I don't know. There's a bridge. These roads are kind of strange the way they sit way up high off the ground like this. Uh, but we probably can get over it this way. Let's go. Uh, where's my coffee? There it is. Yeah, we're going to just zip through town real quick. Oh, I just took a drink of my coffee. Almost went down the wrong way. Thank God it didn't. Oh, man, I love this forest. It's really nice. Still not had any guards or anything like that show up, so I don't know. I, I, I'm guessing at some point in time they're going to pop up. Last time we had the when the hunters were around, it was when we uh, rescued Cynthia. She's, they started showing up the hunters. What do we got in here? Let's just take a look real quick and see what this is. It's like a barn or some sort. Some sort. I would expect to find, like, nails or something in here. This is very similar to the other town we were in. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, look at that. There's somebody here. They're walking towards us. Okay, so there is someone here now. There are people in the towns. Okay, so we're going to have to watch out for that for sure. Yeah, okay, interesting. Okay, cool. Well, let's raid a couple of these guys real quick. We're okay, health-wise. There's some more boxes right here real quick. Just to do a little a little looting. Oh, jeez, there's nothing in there. Anyway. There's another person right there. Wow, okay, so they're they're here. They're here. Let's go to our inventory. Let's take a look at our map real quick. Uh, the easiest way is going to be going to go over this way here. So let's go ahead and set our marker for over here. Yeah, let's let's go this way. And then we'll turn and head over to the uh, where I think the cave might be. So the guards are out, are up and running now. And they're like patrolling too, which is kind of cool. Well, not kind of cool. It is cool. Oh, there we go. I could use that. We're going to need that for building. Oh, man. Nice. You know what I've not found yet is any of those medicinal herbs yet. I'm a little surprised. 
Uh, let's just check. Let's just check these things real quick. Oh my god, each one of these is separate. I thought it was a whole unit, but it's not. Oh my gosh. Alright, let's get out of here. Did we, did, did we check this one? We did this one already, right? Yeah. No, loot desk. I guess if there's nothing in it, oh, there it reads empty now. There we go, okay. Once you open it and close it, it does read empty. Okay, we're out of here. We'll, we'll pick on a guard at a different time. Right now, I'm kind of curious about this cave idea. <clears throat> Getting into a cave would be kind of fun. I've never been in one before. I've shot guards before. We're doing good. Water's down a little bit, but we're running the whole time, so... Kind of expected, I guess. You guys told me the caves are pretty easy to see. I feel like it's right over that way there. I feel like the cave is in that area right over there. Oh, we're going to have to take that bridge to get over there, it looks like. I'll take you with me. Wow, potatoes are kind of scarce too, man. I was really kind of hoping to find some more potatoes as well. I'm always open for that. Just to kind of keep my uh, my uh, carbs taken care of. There is farming, so we could farm eventually. I guess it's possible we could run into some of these guys out here too. Out in the wild here. I just don't want to throw myself down the hill. Oh, let's grab this. When I see this, I grab it. Because they're hard to spot. There we go. Oh, there's some potatoes right there. Perfect. <clears throat> well, we're, if, we're, if there's a cave over here, we're gonna be we're gonna be in iron all day long. That's a nice lake. I really think these bodies of water that are inland should be fresh water, uh, unless they're being fed by the ocean through some sort of a, a cave thing. Uh, you know, then then I understand why it's salt water, but it really should be fresh water, if you ask me. Uh, yes. Okay, so we're almost to where we need to be for the road to take us to where we want to get to. It's it's a big world now, isn't it? Those of you who are familiar with this game are probably like, wow, this place got huge. There's another town. Beautiful. We're here. We're on the road. It takes some doing, but I managed to jump that rail finally. It uh, it just happened to... I don't know if I hit it the right angle or what, but yeah, I finally got over it. This is not a cave right here, though. Uh, I was hoping it was. Well, you know what? I think if I go a little bit further, let's see if maybe it changes here. I'm going to grab a little iron just so I have some. And uh, I should probably grab a little bit of wood, too, because um, my bow is just about shot. And I'm going to need some fiber here. Jimba, look out, tree's coming down. Uh, I ran into a bear out here, too. I would not actually ran into it, but there is a bear somewhere in the woods here. Alright, so let's make another bow. I wonder if that's supposed to be that way, or if there's something wrong. Meaning that uh, we're, you know, 
having to make bows that often. The bows seem to last a little bit longer than it, than I thought it was supposed to. Uh, over this way. There should be like a groove. I see a pig. It'd be worth getting, but nah, I've got some meat on me now. I did find a, uh, well, a wolf. Come on now. I'm here. I'm looking. Perhaps down inside this valley here at the end of it is the cave. Hmm. It doesn't look like it, huh? I thought it was going to be right down in there. Yeah, it's not here. Wow, we're way the heck over there. I see some iron, but I do not see what I was what we're looking for here is the cave. Too bad. There's a lot of this um, gray stone right here. At least what it looks like from the mountain, on the mountain side. Oh, wow. Darn it, I thought for sure that was going to be it. I thought of all the areas on the map that looked like it was a cave, it was that, that groove right there, but that is not the case. Mmm. That, uh, that is really too bad. we got a town over here. A, a good-sized town at that. Yeah, it's not here. I don't think it's here. The only other thing I thought of was we've got we've got an area right here we could take a look at. Um, this is interesting right through here. All this stuff right here looks kind of interesting. Other than that, I don't really see anything that looks like a cave, and I can't zoom in any closer. This is as close as you can get. This could be, I mean, it's, it's, uh, it's a lot. It's a lot to take in. There's, there's this valley up here too, this little hole up here as well. That could be something also. Um. Yeah, this might be a bust. I'm basically going to start running back towards the house is what I'm going to do. I mean, we have what we need to get started on stuff. Uh, the water is the last thing we need to get, and we know we've got the resources to do that, so it's not a big deal. We've got that covered. On foot, though, it's a challenge to get around because it's, it's a huge place, which is awesome. I love the fact that it's it's big. Don't get me wrong. I do. I think it's really awesome that it's going to take some doing to find it. I thought I saw something on the ground there. Hmm. I thought for sure there's gonna be a cave right here. 
There is not, though. Hmm. Not sure what to do now. Well, we know this is here. We know what's, what is over here. So I guess we've explored this. So we now we know inventory. I know I can sell these. I'm just getting rid of them. I've got no storage to just be storing this stuff. So eventually we'll be, we'll be holding on to those things and selling them to the traders. If they still buy the broken stuff. I don't know why they would buy broken tools and bows, but... All right, I'm going to keep working my way around this lake here and see if I see anything that uh, makes me think cave. I'll be back. Made my way to that, that other marker that I was kind of interested in. It's just a big divot in the earth here. I don't see a cave down in here either. I've been grabbing some iron and a few other things as I'm running by. But yeah, I don't see a cave down here. I mean, it's possibly could be tucked away in those trees down there, but I don't think it is. There's some potatoes. I'll grab those. Yeah, there's no cave down here. It's just a it's just a hole in the ground. That's the other spot I thought might be kind of interesting to look at there, but uh, it's not the case. So I don't think I'm going to find the cave over here. I'm 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 guessing now maybe it's over in here somewhere. Yeah, if you know where it is, let me know. That's fine. Since we're kind of uh, testing out this version, I'm, I'm, a, I'm pretty sure we're going to have to uh, start over at some point in time. The walls on the bridges need to be shrunk down a little bit so you can jump over them better. Uh, they're a little tall. It sure is a neat forest, though. I'm, I'm enjoying running around in here and taking a look at it. It's pretty cool. Oh, I'm on the beach just below where we're going to be setting up shop. No luck on the cave. Uh, I kind of... I can't say I looked great, but, you know, I've, I've run all the way through here. I stayed off of the road. So I've gone through here, and there's nothing that says cave to me there. So again, if you know, let me know where it is. I would love to go visit the cave, and uh, I'll go find the other ones on my own on the other islands. I'm kind of curious as to just where it is. But uh, if I get the water basin set up, we're pretty much free to just head off in each direction. So we're going to be searching for that cave. That's going to be uh, something we want to do to further the quest line along. Uh, we know now that the guards are inside the town, so when we go raiding, we're going to have to be a little more careful about that. Uh, it's going to get dark here pretty quick. I just got back in the nick of time before the sun went down. So there we are. Boom, we made it back. Perfect. Now, question is, I've got 9, 14. Uh, I need to take that out of there. Inventory. There's 15 water bottles. What else did we need? We needed some screws. And what else to make this guy right here? This water tank. Uh, three iron ingots. So I've got one iron ingot on me. Uh, we need two more. Okay. That's all right. I could, I could do two more. There we go. It's going to take a minute. So we're going to do that. We're going to get this water basin set up. And then we're going to be good to go. We've got the food and the water and all that stuff situated. So... Uh, taking those water bottles with me was perfect. I've got 68 out of 100 water right now. Doing just fine. Um, you know, it's, uh, and we've got water, we've got water uh, in here that we can, uh, you know, still use, including some murky water. There's a murky water in here too. You know, I think I've got the water actually in here. Yeah, there we go. So let's take these empty jars. We'll throw them in here. There we go. Uh, eventually all this stuff is going to go, all the drink stuff goes into, oh boy, we're, we've got stuff spoiling like crazy. Do the potatoes have, they, have, they got spoilers on them too now. It used to be that you could just, um, the stuff didn't spoil while it was sitting here, but now it does. Oh, that's what's spoiling. Hmm, that's not good. I don't like the fact that that's spoiling like that. We're going to have to do something about that. Uh, oops, I'm going to turn that off. And I think I've got all I need now. 
uh, iron, plastic bottles, the screws. Should be able to make the water tank now. There we go. Just like that. That's going to take five minutes to go. Yeah. Hmm. Our carb foods are spoiling. Not so good. Not so good at all. All right. I'll be back when this is done uh, making. Oh, wait, wait. Before I go, what's this here? Saw bench. Okay, we're going to have to go get more iron and stuff like that. Nails and everything else. Get the saw bench going. Saw bench is nice to have as well. Yeah, they're all nice to have. They're all great workstations. It's a lot of fun. Mechanical parts. How do you make, oh, copper and ingot? Do you make those in here? There was a wall unit that I had not made yet, and I'm kind of curious as to what I need to do. This is magnesium. Okay. Oh, uh, yeah. We're going to see. We're going to have to. There's so much to do. There's a ton of stuff to do. It's really all about the crafting, too. I like that a lot. A lot of great crafting stuff in here. Uh, we could throw this in here. That and that. And we could, uh, that's 12 wood right there. We don't need to throw that in there. Let's do that and that. we got tons of fiber, uh, which, of course, is made into... We can make the cloth with that. I'm pretty sure I've got some cloth already. Yeah, there we go, right there. I could use another storage chest for sure. Uh, and then we were making some nail molds, weren't we? We made uh, nail molds. There we go, just like that. And we drop those in there. And nails. I can do two. Okay. So what is that? How many? What do you get for a nail mold, anyways? Is it? I think it's five nails out of a nail mold. Well, let's see. We got, uh, I don't know, I've got 40 nails now. So that's that's pretty cool. I can make a couple of foundations with that, most definitely. We get something going here. Next episode, we'll probably be doing some building. So I can go actually here, foundations. I can make two. And there we go, I've got 10 nails left. It's not much, but it's better than nothing. So we're doing all right. We are doing just fine, I think. Yeah, I may take uh, this over, this the rest of this iron right here, and go ahead and, yeah, I'm going to turn that rest of that into iron ingots so we can make a bunch of nails and get busy with that because we're going to need to. This guy's got two and a half minutes left. I'll be right back. Welcome back. Dun, 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 dun. There we go, very nice. Drop that in, drop that in, that and that. And we should be able to do jars of murky water. Like so. It's going to take two minutes, but then we just have to take those and cook them up. And we've got ourselves uh, water. Matter of fact, I should actually throw this one. Oh, oops, I just didn't take it back out. There we go. I should throw this one in here and make a bottle of water. Like so. Yeah, these guys just fill up. So now our water situation is fine. We're good with water. We're not going to run out. Uh, I don't think this thing breaks down after time. It looks to me like it just kind of stays the way it is. So uh, we've got one of these. That's that's the main goal right there is to have water. So we're, we're good to go. So campfire off. You can see my temperature starts to drop uh, without the fire pit on. So I, I don't know if it really matters, but I try to keep it on and then I just kind of stand next to it so the temperature kind of goes back up again. But now we've got our water. I've got a couple of foundations made. I think I want to get um, at least a few more so we can kind of get the work, the outdoor workstation kind of set up and ready to go along the edge of that cliff. And then we'll start working on the house uh, itself. Um, not in a super hurry to get to the cave we could do a little bit of building we can't build too much because we don't have a whole lot of cement we need cement and I don't know how to make cement I've never made that yet so I don't know but we have six I believe that's only enough to make one wall if I'm not mistaken yeah yeah so uh, it takes uh, a bit of material to do that it takes two cement to make half walls there's some wooden railings oh those are nice I'm thinking about the wooden railings on the outside of the porch around the back side, the back area there. Wooden stairs. Yeah, there's some fun stuff in here for sure. Wooden walkway. Oh, wooden walkway wall. Okay, gotcha. 
Uh, and how are we doing here? Uh, oh, seven seconds. So I wouldn't mind doing a little building, but we do need to get to wherever we need, or whatever it is we need for the um, uh, cement. Don't know what that is, but we got to do it. And there we go. Water situation handled. So now we have food, we have water, we have all that good stuff. Uh, we're good to go. All right, I hope you guys enjoyed today's episode. If you did, do hit that like button for me. Comment, subscribe, and share. I'm the Radio Man 03. I want you to have an awesome, fantastic, and a superb day. And I do look forward to talking to you again next time.